This video will look at the steps involved in creating a new library staff account in Sitka's Evergreen. In Evergreen, library staff accounts are the same as patron accounts with two differences. One, staff accounts use main profile permission groups with permissions that give access to Evergreen staff functions. Two, staff accounts have working locations which tell Evergreen which libraries or branches an account can be used at. Register your staff member as you would a patron, taking the following into consideration. Staff accounts can use real patron barcodes from your barcode range or a barcode you create. When logging into the Evergreen staff client, staff must use their username, not their barcode. This is especially important for staff to know if their barcode and username are different. It is best practice to use a temporary password and then have staff reset their password to something only they know. Staff can change their password by logging into My Account in the Public Catalog or by using the Forgot Your Password link if their account has an email address. For an account to be a staff account, it needs to have a main profile permission group with library staff permissions. This example shows public library staff permission groups. A similar list of groups is available for each library type. Choose the appropriate permission group for the access the staff member needs. A table is available in Sitka's Evergreen documentation to show what staff functions different permission groups can perform. For local system administrator accounts, choose any permission group, as you will need to contact support to have the local system administrator permission group assigned to the account. To add a working location to a staff account, retrieve the account in the staff client. Click on Other, and from the drop-down menu, select User Permission Editor. Select your library from the Working Locations section. Multi-branch systems will have all branches display. If the staff member works at multiple branches, check the boxes for all applicable branches. Use the inner scroll bar to scroll to the bottom of the page, and click Save. Library staff accounts without working locations cannot load the patron registration or edit screens. To use certain aspects of Sitka's Evergreen, library staff need additional permissions assigned to their account. To use the Acquisitions module, library staff must have ACK Admin, Purchaser, or Selector permissions. The ACK Administrator at the library can assign purchaser and selector permissions through the edit screen in the patron account. To do so, click Secondary Groups beside Main Profile Permission Group, select the appropriate permission group from the drop-down menu, click Add, click Apply Changes, and save the account. For accounts requiring ACK admin permissions, please contact support with the barcode of the library staff account. Staff requiring access to Evergreen's reporter or the ability to view report output must first fill out the appropriate privacy waiver. Reporter permissions will not be granted to generic library accounts. The reporter privacy waivers are available on Sitka's Evergreen support page on the BC Library's cooperative website. Staff needing access to the reporter within Evergreen to create, run, and view reports need to fill out the full reporter privacy waiver. Staff needing access to view report output sent to them by a staff member with full reporter access need to fill out the All Staff Reporter Privacy Waiver. Before filling out a waiver, make sure your library staff account contains your first and last name, email address, phone number, and address. Incomplete accounts will not be granted reporter permissions. Submitting the waiver automatically sends it to support so the applicable permission group can be assigned. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.